everybody, I'm Amy. Welcome to my channel and thanks for joining me for a My Little Pony inspired craft. As you can see, I'm a big fan. Today, I'm going to show you how to make a My Little Pony desk lamp. You can find links for all the materials you will need for this project in the description below the video, both on YouTube and at craftymcfangirl.com. You will need a lamp with straight sides and a fabric shade. My Little Pony licensed fabric, scissors, Mod Podge mat, a paintbrush, and a glue gun and glue sticks. Start by looking at your fabric. Before you cut, make sure that the ponies you want on your lamp will be positioned well. I want Rainbow Bright. Applejack and Fluttershy to fit on my lampshade. When you cut the fabric, make sure to leave an inch of extra fabric on the top and bottom of the shade. Cover your table with something to protect your work surface and get out your Mod Podge for the next part. Before you start gluing the fabric, make sure that your shade is right side up and that your fabric is facing the correct direction. Next, find the back of the fabric shade by looking for the seam. Use Mod Podge to glue the fabric to the shade starting at the seam. Work slowly and carefully in sections around the entire shade. Make sure the shade and the fabric have a generous coating of Mod Podge and make sure there's no folds or bubbles in the fabric. Then add a coat of Mod Podge to the outside of the fabric. Once you have full coverage, let the project dry completely before continuing. Heat up your glue gun for the next part. Once the Mod Podge is dry, trim off any extra fabric, leaving just enough to fold over and glue. Working in sections, glue down the fabric edges inside the shade. The final step is to assemble the lamp, and your My Little Pony lamp is done. Just add a light bulb and brighten your room My Little Pony style. Thanks so much for crafting with me today and have fun making your lamp. If you enjoyed this craft and you would like to see what's coming next, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. And I'll see you next time.